Let me check real quick down there with this. And would you please stand for the national anthem.
volunteers, recreation department, teachers, educators that are here today to help support this program. I couldn't help but read the mission of the Special Olympics, and these words, they really stood out for me. Athletic competition in a variety of Olympic-type sports, giving them continuing opportunities to develop physical fitness, demonstrate courage, experience joy in participating and sharing of gifts, skills, and friendship with their family and other Special Olympic athletes in the community. Wow, this must be the place to be today. Yes, it is. So I want to thank you for being here. Wish all the athletes all the luck. And let the games begin. Part two, let's begin coming up in just a few. We're in just a minute. Thank you so much, Dr. Ellis. We have Mr. Anthony. Tony B. Harris. Yes. Woo -hoo. He's going to be doing our own. All oh, athletes, please stand. Repeat after me. Let me win, win. but if I cannot win, win. let me break your attempt. Thank you. Yes, thank you. Anthony said that he was shy and a little nervous. You did an excellent job, excellent job this morning. Officials, where are you? All officials, where are you? All right, if you are an official or judge, please raise your hand. In the name of all judges and officials, I promise that we shall officiate in these Special Olympics Games competitions with complete impartiality, respecting and abiding by the rules which govern them in the spirit of sportsmanship. If you agree with this, please say, I do. All right, now the volunteers. Where are my volunteers? Raise your hands in the air. Now, look. Every time I, I, I get the chance to hear you all on the peak oath, y'all be a little, a little lower in volume. But I want to hear you this time. And we have Miss Rebecca Morgan, who's going to administer the oath. I want to hear you volunteers as she administers the oath. Good morning. Please repeat the first part after me. I will fulfill the responsibilities of my assignment. I will set a good example for the athletes. I will demonstrate good sportsmanship and cooperation. I will be diligent and aware of the safety of the athletes. For the remainder of us, please raise your hand. I will refrain from the consumption of alcoholic beverages and non-prescribed controlled substances. I will wear my credential identification provided by SONC and understand that it must be visible during events. And I am specifically granted permission to special Olympics to use my likeness, voice, words, and media for the purposes of advertising or communicating the purposes and activities of special Olympics. If you agree with this, please say I do. Thank you. Thank you. Great job. Great job. All right. Who has the honor of lighting the torch? Oh, okay. Anthony. Anthony's going to light the torch, and I'm going to stand over here on the corner. I might need to step down on the stage. Woo! Okay. <laughs> Thank you so much. Yeah. A little windy, but <laughs> special instructions. As always, Mark Davis, our game director. <laughs> Good morning. How are you doing? I'm going to tell you where to go, where each event is going to be. If you look to my right, this way. If you go out that back alley back there, go through those gates, softball throws located on the practice football field. Down here in this end, you got standing long jump on the field at the end of the track where the track event is going to be. Behind me in the middle of the field, you have tennis ball throw. 
Down here to my left is novice beanbag toss, the distance ball roll, and developmental track is on the far end over here by those orange cones. Thank you. Thank you, Mark. Thank you. Again, we cannot do this without you, our volunteers, our athletes, each and every one of you, and of course our sponsors. So if you happen to be a representative of any of the sponsors I'm about to name, make sure you make some noise. Thank you, United Way, Rocky Mountain Community Foundation, Body Noel. And before we hit the field, when I say stop,